Hello YouTube. Um, I'm going to be showing you guys how to do chain earrings. So far I have this here and um, I'm going to show you guys what I have so far. This is what I have so far. It's a chain like earring and it's really kind of long. Okay, and I have the black feather up here and the white feather down here. Now I'm going to show you guys how I do this. Um, this earring is not finished, so I'm going to show you guys how I finish it. Um, I have another video. This is my second part of the video. I have my first part of the video shows you how I did this, okay? This video is going to be more professional, I guess you can say, because there's not a lot of noise in the background. Um, Thanks for um, watching this video. So we're going to get started and I'm going to show you guys what we need. Today, um, you don't have to watch the first video because uh, I know a lot of videos like this. You have to watch the first video in order to know what's going on, but not here. You're going to need these jumping, these jump rings. They're about, I would like to say, $3 in a big pack app. Michael's, Walmart, or Hobby Lobby, they all have different prices, but they're really cheap. You will need these little finding pieces. They look just like this. They're little findings. We're going to need those. Feathers, most importantly, feathers. You're going to need feathers, okay, you guys? Feathers are very important to use. That's why we're doing what we're doing now. It's all because of the feathers, okay? This is the last <clears throat> thing that I made with the finding that I just showed you guys. And this is how we're going to get started. Everything is pretty simple and stuff. Everything is easy. So after I took this, I'm going to take a jump ring. I'm going to take a jump ring and I am going... I'm going to open it. Sorry about that noise in the background, you guys. That's my little brother and my dog, Cody. So, now this is going to be pretty simple. You're just going to take the finding. It's like a little loop there. And you're going to stick the jump ring into that loop. Then you're going to stick the loop onto the earring which is fairly simple okay so after we do this we're going to close it so this way it'll stay on the chain now now this is the easy part. It's not hard because um, it doesn't matter. You need um, hooks, the hook pieces that go on your earring. I do not have those to show you right now, but because I ran out. But I'm gonna get some more soon, and then I you can also watch my other videos to see what it looks like. Now these kinds are really cool. They come in a pack like this. And you can get these at Hobby Lobby. Hobby Lobby is the only place I know of that you can get the ones like this. Um, I'm going to do the same thing that I've been doing. And I'm going to take this finding. No, Cody. I'm going to take this finding. And I'm going to stick it on to the Can now, this is simple. You're just going to stick the finding onto the feather, just like that. Once you, once you do that, you're going to close it. Now you're going to close it, and it's going to be really simple. And you know that once you close it like that, it's going to look just like that. And then you're going to push it down. And now it's going to close. And now you have your earring just like that. Sometimes there's pieces sticking up on there. And what you can do is cut them off. 
your hands. Sorry about all that noise in the background. It's my mom. Okay. Just like that. Now you're going to take your O-ring, open it up. It's really called a jump ring, but I call them O-rings. Stick it through the finding. Okay. There's a little loop in there. You're going to take your O-ring and... Oh. Sorry, guys. It fell out of my hand. You're going to take... Oh. You're going to take your O-ring and flip it right... Right through. Now you're going to stick the feather onto the earring. So far we have this. Now you're going to stick your feather right onto the earring. And then you close it. And now that feather is on there, the white feather that we use. Um, you can get all this stuff at Walmart, Hobby Lobby, or Michaels. Um, yeah, the feathers are the most important thing. I also have videos on how to do other types of feather earrings. If you do not like the chain earrings, I have videos on how to do shorter earrings. Um, and I will soon have a video on how to do feather hand cinches. Okay, um... This is a very easy process. You're also going to need these little chains if you didn't already notice, but you can find these at Michaels. You're better off finding them at Michaels or than Walmart or Hobby Lobby. Okay, so, so far, we have this one earring. Bam, looks just like that. Black and white. Just the color that I need. It's really pretty. Thanks for watching YouTube. Um, if you guys have any questions or if I didn't explain something the right way, please let me know so that way I can explain better next time. Please subscribe me and watch my other videos. You don't even have to subscribe. I just want to help you guys out by watching my videos. Thank you so much. And um, if you uh, message me, if you would like to... If you want me to make a special type of video, uh, I have a Facebook. My name is Destiny Payne, and my name is shown right here at the bottom of the screen. So, thanks for watching, YouTube. You guys are so awesome, and continue watching. Thank you.